take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. So the idea is to use stacked terracotta pots and a couple of candles to generate enough heat to warm a room. A candle flame only puts out so much heat, and it's small compared to even a modest electric space heater. Make your mark, take our lead. Boiling a pot of water will help in a minor barely noticeable way unless the room is very small. But using the boiling water to make tea and then drinking the hot tea, preferably with some biscuits, will help you to warm up regardless of what the thermometer says. Take our lead. 20 candles. Short version, to heat a room, you need 20 candles. According to research, the heating power of one candle is ADW. Therefore 20 candles are about the equivalent of 11600W space heater. A candle heat source of 1600W combined is able to heat a room thoroughly. Make your mark, take our lead. A candle can produce levels of carbon monoxide which are measurable. If something were to happen to the candle and it were to tip over, it could cause a fire. If a candle is left burning in an enclosed space, there will be enough carbon monoxide built up in the room to potentially cause some serious health issues. Point two four July 2019. Make your mark, take our lead. Can a candle cause carbon monoxide poisoning? The simple answer to this question is yes, it can. If a candle is left burning in an enclosed space, there will be enough carbon monoxide built up in the room to potentially cause some serious health issues. Point two four July 2019. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.